Welcome back. Chinese New Year is this Saturday, January 25th. And it's the year of the rat. It's actually my year. And Chef Phil Fuller is here with a dish to help us celebrate. And you're a wood rat. Is that, I don't know. Well, so the, 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 chi <laughs> the Chinese zodiac goes through the animals all around. Right. There's 12 of them. And then there's another elemental zodiac that has five elements that it also rotates through. So every 60 years, like, it's a certain element with a certain animal. Like, this year's the metal rat. Oh, but like you, heavy metal. Well, a metal. ACDC um, rat, right? <laughs> however you want to see it in your head. <laughs> okay. It's the metal rat. All but right. So I think three cycles. Wait, what year were you born? 84. 84 was wood. Okay. I checked that. Oh, I don't know this. Wow. I just checked yeah. it. It's really good. I was going to say. And what are you, year of the what? I don't know. I didn't check that. Oh, gosh. Do you yeah. know I what you no are? I have no idea. No idea. Okay. What I do well. know is you've already made some beautiful things here. <laughs> Let's and we're going to get to eat, right? I think I mean I think you guys need to eat. Yeah. And so so what we're doing this week is um this uh, uh, this dim sum menu is soba where we have a bunch of small items that people grab and share. And the way people eat is like they get a whole bunch of stuff to share. So I thought I would give you guys a lot of stuff to share. A lot of stuff to share. And dim sum. Tell us about dim sum. So dim sum is very popular. It's just small plates. Okay. You know, and if you go to actually a dim sum restaurant in New York, they'll push a cart around. Right. And then, you know, as, as they come by, you'll get some dumplings here or some fried things there or whatever. And then they just, bring the buffet to you. Yes. That's my kind of yes. meal. That's the best thing ever. It's the <laughs> <laughs> so while I'm finishing the last dish, okay. let's see. You want to pull those lids off? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So let's see. Over there are Ooh. our pork dumplings. Ooh, this looks good. With a good. little bit of a light dipping sauce. Mm -hmm. This is so good. Um, is that is, what it's called? <laughs> yes, it's so good. It's, <laughs> it's a, per, a Persian cucumber and roasted carrot salad with a green tahini sauce. It's so good. If you don't like it, pretend because I'll be hurt. <laughs> okay. I want you All to right. put that on your menu. It is on. It's so it is. good. It is. It's so, it's so good. It's so good salad. That's what what I is want. this? Yeah. This is beautiful. Oh, this is so good. That's just a little tuna tartare with uh, yuzu aioli with Ooh. some crispy lotus root on top. Th that's what that's lotus that's fruit. Lotus root. Root. Oh, okay. Wow. Uh, a little bit so of pretty. homemade uh, wonton soup there with the chicken broth and some woodier mushrooms. Look mm -hmm. how cute. It's not cute. I'm sorry. <laughs> and, well, it's a little bowl. <laughs> and these are Nepalese dumplings called momos, with a little bit of uh, tomato uh, cumin dipping sauce. Awesome. And this is Szechuan lamb dumplings. Oh my god. <laughs> so, Bill, where do we even start? What should we try first? I think you maybe have a little soup, and then okay. start. Um, have a dumpling before okay. they get cold. Okay. Have some tartare, and I will whip. I will make the last plate. You got mushrooms over there, and that's. Oh, these are not mushrooms, sir. Oh, what are they? These are baby octopus. Oh my gosh! They, oh. <laughs> With a little fresh oh. tomato wow. dipping sauce, and they're they're nice, roasted in the cast iron pan. That soup is delicious. They're delicious. Wow. Wow, you look really excited, Heather. This is great. I do like calamari, but fried. And I do not like to see the heads on my animals when I eat them, if I do. <laughs> and that's a Seems like a reasonable rule. <laughs> All right, so we should try the dumplings. Okay. Start eating the dumplings. Right. And I will squeeze yeah. the, the lime on the octopus here. Okay. And so tell us about what you guys do at Soba for Chinese New Year. Oh, you so offered a little dim sum. You we, we offer this dim sum menu, and Thank I have you. a stack of the menus there in front of David. And so it's, we, do, we do, so you come in, you check off the things you want, like in a, like, in some mm -hmm. dim sum places, mm -hmm. and we bring it out to you, and we eat it, and uh, you eat too much food, because that's what you do at a dim sum place. Right. Mm -hmm. That is so good. And um, you have a lot of fun. How are you doing with the chopsticks? I think okay. You're killing it. Yeah, mm -hmm. he has emergency forks for us, is what he told us earlier. I make it work. Emergency forks. That's what that's what happens. I make it work. I don't know if I'm doing it correctly. So in, in our family, you know, my daughter's in college and my son's in high school, and so we all can use chopsticks except for my daughter. She can't, and like. She has kind of refused to learn how to use chopsticks. It's almost she's, oh, really? all, she's kind of aggressive about it, and so we'll go out to you know a Chinese restaurant or a Japanese restaurant, and we'll all get chopsticks, and she'll insist on having a fork. She wants to be different. She just refuses. But we have some pictures to show of Soba, which is in Shady Side of the place, all decked out for Chinese New Year. We added a bunch of red lanterns and kind of redded it up mm -hmm. a little bit. Okay. What do you think of this? Now, what is, what is this? You said so it's roasted carrots and Persian cucumbers okay. in a little uh, tahini cilantro dressing. Wow. That's great because it's cool and then there's a, like a bite of hot. A little, a little zip in there. There's a, some togarashi, which is a, a spice mix on top. Togarashi? Togarashi. Wow. Do you want to try it? Yeah, I'll try. Okay, I'm going to give this to you and I'm going to okay. try it. So, them. what I would recommend Dumpling. here, just to help you out, is just yeah. I don't know how my chopsticks I would just take a whole octopus and. Okay. Just do it. Go for it, David. Take a whole octopus and I don't know if I'll use the, I'll use the chopsticks, I guess. Is this your favorite time of the year? 
<laughs> uh, I love dim sum menu. I love I love going out for dim sum. Now, how do you eat? The, do you pop this whole thing in your mouth? Well, this would be hard. Well, I would bite. I would like half half and bite. Or stab it. Stab it. Are you gonna are you gonna do that? <laughs> I'm gonna Let's follow you with the bowl. Are you really gonna do that? Go. Well, no, I don't know if I can. Can you read after me? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here we go. Bill, what, what is this sauce? Mm -hmm. It's a little uh, a fresh, some fresh tomatillos mm -hmm. and some lime and a little bit of garlic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it's just to, to kind of balance the sort of rich sweetness. We uh, coat the octopus in some sweet soy before we grill it. Mm -hmm. That's kind of a little balance. Yeah, it's great. It's great. That, that's been the uh, that's been the sleeper of the whole menu. We thought we'd sell like a couple a night, and we're selling out every night of the it's octopus. Good. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I got to try this too. I still can't talk. You still can't talk. <laughs> nice job with that, though. It was really good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm. Thank you. And how's the tartare? It's good too. Yeah. And this will go all the way up through into Chinese New Year. And um, we're having oh. a lot of fun with it. Nice. Fantastic. So good. Thank okay. you, Bill. Thanks, Thanks for feeding for us. Me. We love it when you stop by. And thank you to you at home for watching us eat for five minutes. We <laughs> <laughs> appreciate you staying with us. Bill Fuller, <laughs> executive chef of the Big Burrito Restaurant Group, and that includes Soba Lounge, which is celebrating Chinese New Year in Shadyside through Saturday. You want to stop in? Very delicious. Mm -hmm. Still to come in today's Kidsburg Report, one in six mothers suffers from postpartum depression. We'll tell you what you need to know about this disorder and how you can get help. Plus, we will get you ready for the weekend with our roundup of what's happening around town. Comedy, dance, musicals, and more. We have it all for you. That's just ahead on PTL.